Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Mob Impressions, the show where we play a game for about half an hour or so, and at the end I'll give you my honest and true thoughts. Today, we're going to play a game called Robothorium. This game is actually in early access right now, uh, so let's go ahead and check it out. It is described as a sci-fi dungeon crawler. This is my first time ever opening the game, so let's go ahead and get started. Let's check out the settings before we jump right in. Languages, English, ooh, a lot of them. Resolution, okay. Audio feels good. Gamepad on. You can you can play it with Twitch. And let's see. Display wheel. Automatically sell common items. Fight speed. Show tutorials. Send anonymous dates to help the devs. Yoink! All right, let's go. <laughs> let's get this done. All right. So it's my first time ever playing this game. Wish me luck. Uh, difficulty. Okay, rebellion. Recommended for beginners. Familiar. Hey, we're beginners. Let's go ahead and see what's going on here. Uh, your robots come back to your team when destroyed. Ooh. All right. Well, let's just go ahead and get started here. All right. 2052 robots have been endowed with a state-of-the-art artificial intelligence. You guys really think that's ever going to happen in any of us any in, anytime soon? Maybe in 100 years. <laughs> Probably not. All right. Anyway, let's see what's going on here. Ooh, very cool. So, uh, yeah, easy, medium, hard. Is this like some sort of... Um, with a dungeon crawler, right? You think it's gonna be anything like FTL, maybe? A civil war threatens USAIA, an artificial intelligence program for a single purpose, offering a future to robots. Whoa, we're on the robots team? We're gonna fight humans or what? I'm down. Bring it on. Well, let's go. Doo -doo. Hmm, interesting. Oh, Robothorium. So I, I believe the, um, you know, the final game or the, the final, what's it called? Uh, the full release should be coming out fairly soon. If this is version like 9.6.2 or something. I think that's what it said in the main story. Whoa, okay. Sarah Simov. Hello. The emissary of Rebel Faction. We're here to help you. Hurry up and get out. Go ahead and take control of three of them. The idling robots. Whoa. Alright. What do we got here? So we can choose between a couple of these. Yeah, I don't know who to pick. So I'm just going to grab um, one of these. Oh, here we go. We select it. I don't know. I'm just going to pick the first three. And we'll, uh, we'll find out what's going on. Is there an American one? Germany, Russia, Japan, Brazil, China, France. No America robots. Feels bad, man. All right, let's just jump right into it. Not sure what's the best pick, so let's just get on. Doo -doo -doo. Is this like a roguelike game? You are currently located in a break tech lab. Take some time to look around. Scanning your surroundings should be an easy task for AI as advanced as yourself. All right. So, WSD to go to different rooms, mini map to find your way, achieve the goal to end the mission. The mission is to escape. Here's the danger level. All right, uh, success chance of actions lowered, enemy speed and power maximum danger. All right, so we can zoom in, we can zoom out of the map. You got equipment. Pretty sure they'll teach us about. Oh, okay, never mind. You can change your robot's equipment to increase efficiency, attributes modified by equipment, and when leveling up. All of your items go in your inventory. Robots can be affected uh, by bonuses or penalties. You got it. So right now we have a repair bot, we have a lady, and we have a war. Uh, I mean, the UI is a little crazy. Let's see what we got here. We got shields, structures, the, it's the <laughs> structure is your HP. Shield, uh, resistance to all damage, regeneration from shield at the beginning of each turn. This is a uh, power, crit, and speed. All right, well, let's just keep going then. I got 50 bucks up here, I guess. All right, whoa. Okay, I'm gonna press W. Yep, that took us right up. Okay, interactive elements. You can interact, open storage, and there's a success chance. Choose carefully. It might change the course of the story in future. The story, 75, 70% chance? Of course we're going for that, right? All right, if they left some weapons laying around, we should use that to arm ourselves. We got something called an energy catalyst, which is going to be in our equipment. So no one has a weapon on. No, no, they do have a weapon. We have this ionizer, 32, and uh, whatever that two is. I think that's crit plus bonus. This is a uh, 31, and this is a uh, what are you using here? Revolver. So no one here can use it. As you can see, it's red here. But here, if I cover over him, he's good. So this is a uh, 32. So this is a big upgrade. All right. You can see the sprite changes too. I like that. I like that a lot. It even shows you the... Uh, okay, I can't even hold on to it. it. shows you the rarity right there. 
cool. So we got a new weapon. Feels good. Looks like we got nowhere to go, but W again. Here we go. Rooms unveiling. Some actions allow you to unveil unexplored rooms and to get special bonuses. Zoom the minimap to display it. Hack security camera. Look at that. See, let's see this right here. It's two different rooms. All right, we're gonna hack it. 70% chance. And if we do it, we learn about unexplored rooms. Nice. You've managed to discover some new rooms by hacking. You earn a special bonus if they contain anything important. All right, let's look at the legend here. This is the entrance where we started. This is the mission goal, which I don't even know where the hell. Oh crap, I pressed freaking E by act. Uh, is there a, here we go, M. Okay, is this thing loading or what? Okay, unveiling bonuses. Success chance for actions. Uh, speed is reduced trigger of a trap cancel. So if we know what happens before we go in to an area. Yeah, look at that. So if we know what happens, we get a better success chance to activate it. So you always want to be scouting, I suppose. All right, reformat, 65%. And we got it. We got 10% XP. All right, cool, cool. Let's go up. Ah, oh, check it out. A drone? It's your time to shine, but remember to always ponder the consequences. You will be judged for your deeds, but I'm a robot. We can destroy this, hack it, or deactivate. I want to try hacking it. You know, see what happens. Oh, wow. Whoa. Oh, we got a little thing here. Cool. Droney at your service. Ah, check it out. More unexplored stuff. So now that we know a trap is here, it's not going to affect us. And we know this is here, so the speed is going to be reduced by zip, by lower. So we don't know what's in this room. We can leave here, but it might be better to explore areas. I don't know how this is going to exactly work. Anyways, moving on to the right. Oh, our first battle. 3v3. Neutralize these riflemen if you want to get out of here. Okay, I'm down. Okay, fight. Turn base. You can see turn order. Final Fantasy X wise. Uh, select a fighter to see his details. Choose a skill. Select a target. Uh, target's a single fighter. Oh, a line. Targets all group. Very cool. Uh, most skills generate overload. The basic attack of each robot reduces overload. When you have 100 overload, stunned and unprotected. So try not to get overloaded. Alright, so the high speed goal first. Repair bot. Let's see. Uh, 67 to an enemy. Looks like he gets overloaded a little bit. Regenerates the shield of an ally. That's pretty cool. Uh, applies a thorium mark to an ally. Thorium means their damage taken reduced uh, to an ally. To an ally line. Ah, okay. And then we have a localization. Applies thorial focus to an enemy. So that increases damage on them. And this is what? They're special? I don't know how this works here. Refreshes the duration of all allies' bonuses. Regenerate eight of their maximum shields. So I'm going to press one. And we can activate one of these guys. Speed is reduced. They're surprised. I don't know who's, who we should kill first. Probably the assistant. I feel like he's a support character. We'll shoot him. 90. So you can see here who's going up next. This guy's going up next. He has 40. He has a lot of shield. All right, lady here. Uh, posture. Unmasked. You know what the posture means? That's probably her like ability. Let's see what we got. Rifle shot. Proton shot. Two to random enemies. Oh, that's amazing. That sounds way better than this. And guess what? It uses up... Uh, I think it uses up... Uh, 25... Uh, okay. Deals 91 to an enemy target. Apply short circuit. Cannot use skills generating overload. Oh, that's for one turn because it's strong. Cannot generate overload. Oh, wait. I think these guys get overload too. Yeah. Applies enhanced critical hits to an ally. Okay, so I'm going to use three on this guy. Which means he won't be able to use any skills. He uses a basic attack only. Okay, now it's my lady. I thought it was this guy. Okay, put the mask on. Change the launcher skills to take an address aggressive posture. Put the mask on. Mask on, max off. Let's see. It regenerates the shield of an ally and cooling. Okay. Applies damage transfer to an ally. All damage are shared between the targets. Interesting. Illusion of the show. Applies immaterial barrier. This person does it fight? Anyway, no. I think if we put the mask on. Uh. Yeah, put the mask on. Oh, look, I can switch on and off like that. Yeah, my on or off, on or off. So we have... Oh, yeah, there we go. Uh, apply charm. Regenerate shield of all enemies. Version stock. Apply stock to all enemies. Anyway, let's do this. 
Okay, now we know what our, all, most of our abilities do. Let's see if we can make them work together. Dang, his shield's almost down. Whoa. All right, little guy's going first. How about we just kill them before they can do anything? That's probably the best, right? All right, let's just go for straight attacks. Put that in your pipe -oo. All right, just get him with the attacks. Once again, here we go with the pow proton shot. Doof, doof. Nice. All right, they're going to hit us. Ow. It's probably better to like not have our shields get destroyed, but we're doing okay. So, yeah, this guy's a healer. No problemo. Let's keep going with the attacks. Everyone keeps healing. I don't understand. Power reduced by 25. Why did that happen? Uh, short circuits. All right, anyway, bounce it off. So it hits this guy. Pretty cool. Is it at every one of our levels we go for? 67. All right, so we don't need to do any of this. Basic attack, pretty good weapon. I like how you can switch back and forth and you don't have to worry about your... Um, he just has, like, more skills. All right. Anyway. All right, he's, he's about to overload. Uh, what's this? Short circuit. Actually, we can do this without being worried about overload. There you go. So he can't use a special ability. Hit him again. All right, that was a very, very uh, quick and easy battle. No problem, though. <laughs> All right. Hey, good job. We leveled up. Oh, don't level up. It's very close. Rewards, limbs, catalyst, money. Yo, we could probably put that on, huh? Cool. All right. Nice, nice. Let's go back to our equipment now. All right. A lot of stuff here. Let's see here. Oh, she could put on this limb here. So this is going to be plus 18 shield and plus 3 speed. Nice. What? It doesn't show, huh? I was hoping that would, like, switch. Anyway, let's see here. So none of these guys can use the rest of these. These, that is. This guy can use one of these weapons, though. Let's see. Ah. Check it out. 43 damage. 40, 42, 43. All right. It's not really that big of a buff. Angry. What's angry? All right. Ooh, talents. Look at that. You can level them up and choose. Oh, here's the effect here. Reduce power by 20. Why is it reduced power? I don't understand. Did I get hit by something? Oh, you can rename them. Huh. Cool. Speed increase. Posture mark. All right. Let's keep going. Uh, I can go up and explore more, right? Where am I? To the right? Yeah, the trap shouldn't work. Can hack it, hundred percent. Your robots unveil the trap. Okay, so we got all this treasure. Or we can leave. Well, of course I want. I want to get the damn treasure. Ooh. So this thing would be ten percent lower to do these, but because we uh, looked before, we're good. All threats have been unveiled. Radio terminal. Group of enemy appears. God dang it! You can see them on the map there. Electric meter. I don't know what this does here. We got thorium mark because it messed up. Oh man. Thorium mark means what? 15% more. 2015? Oh, reduced! Oh no, we actually got it. Okay, thorium is good. Here, I'll try another one of these. God dang it. No available room to add a group of enemies. No available room. So we messed up again. Yikes. Alright, we're about to be in another battle right here. Oh, it's the same peoples. Yo. There should be no problem. We can just level up right after this. Alright, let's just get him. Alright. Uh, tick the charm. Let's do the bounce on two. Hey, you survived. Pretty cool. I right, no problem, man. We're great. Woo. All right. Pretty good. If we just use our basic attacks, it's no problem. Hit this baboon. Charmed. Uh, fifty percent of damage evenly regenerates the shield of all enemies. Or generates the shield of all enemies, huh? Very cool. Yeah, there's no way they're getting through it. I mean, this is a... I mean, I think when I read the easy and the hard mode or whatever, it didn't say anything about the difficulty of enemies. It said, like, if, it, if your robot dies, it comes back or it's fully shielded or whatever. Anyways, this is the first room slash tutorial, so it shouldn't be that bad. So, there you go. All right, regular attack. To take off the overload. Oh, right, yeah, it's not bad. We recover way faster than they hurt us. So that's no problem at all. And kill him. Alright, time to level up and see what happens. 
Bink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, look, we got a little animation. Oh, we got some new stuff again. I love it. Yo, fighting enemies are cool. Maybe I should go to the other one to the left over there. Let's look at our equipment. All right, talents. Each robot has additional skills you could buy. Select it to switch it. Oh, cool. All right, let's look at our equipment first, though. Oh, cool. What's this? This is a um, uh, intervention barrier. What's this? It gives us resistance for damage and more shield. Cool. There we go. And can't use these legs. What's this? Thorium dioxide. Use at a workshop. All right. Well, let's see. So, what do we upgrade these? Talents. What the hell? I'm pretty sure everyone has their own tier, right? Probably. So I can reset it as well. What happens if I just click on this? If I click on this, I, I bet it like gets stronger, right? Oh yeah, look, you can level it up. Or switch it out. Wait, you switch it out or you level it up? I think you level, I mean... Huh. Okay, so I can get new skills by doing this and swapping it out. Yeah, look, see? Let's see. Neuronic, so there's three different ones. So you can customize your robot. Or you can level up an ability. More passive stuff. Intimidation Burst also has a chance to do stocks. Energetic Zeal Plus, Galvanization, Unstable Protons. Bounces on half additional enemies. Overload Generation Seal increased by 10. Full Mag. Electric Shock. You know what? I think we should go ahead and upgrade my Unstable Protons. I like that a lot. I like that ability. We'll upgrade it. Yeah. Now bounces on another enemy. Ooh, that's good, huh? That's pretty good. Uh, okay, this guy here. So it's not one of our skills we're not really using a lot here. Let's get rid of the localization for what? It removes a penalty. Uh, quantum bond. Shields regenerates 20% of heals received. It generates the shield. God, it's all healing. All healing. Let's hope he would have something else. Uh, let's see what we got here. Medic. Uh, regenerates more shield. Re renovation. Diagnosis. Uh, I want to upgrade my steel. Okay, shield stabilization. One of nine. Generates. Okay, so it generates more now. 10% more. Good, good. Okay, my lady. Let's see. Oh, she's, she should have a lot of skills here. What's our attack? Our only attack on this character. I should probably level up. Artistic performance. Shock acting. Offended audience. <laughs> Where is artistic performance? Oh, it's probably like one of these things, huh? Yes, yes. There it is. Alright. Well, I don't think this I can get this yet, huh? Oh, here it is. Artistic performance also has a 50 to 100% chance to apply thorium. Oh, that's cool. Thorium focus. Let's take more damage. Oh, cool. cool I like that. Alright, cool. We level them up. Level them up. We have some money, too. Let's leave the area. Leave. Leave. Hey, you did it. You and your robots are safe. Welcome to the rebel base. Yeah, hey, because they finished a mission, they leveled up. So it's kind of like, um, it's pretty similar to Darkest Dungeon, if you guys ever played that. So, yeah. Um, factions. Mission equipment. Hangar. Description. Start. Equipment. Hangar. All right. You'll be able to buy and sell robots. These technological masterpieces are not what you call cheap. No robots for sale. So you can have more in your party. Cool. Oh, yeah, you can sell them, I guess. Scrapyard. Black Market Workshop Arena. Looks like we're probably going to have to finish another mission or so to unlock these things. Hangar. Robots for sale. All right, switch out some equipment here. Hey, oh, we got some new ones here. Some legs. More movement and more HP. Cool. Ah, here we are. We got uh, new arms. This is a uh, 18. Okay, we don't want that. Can I sell it? Oh, new weapon, 35. Oh, that's much better. Oh man, a better cannon. Yo, more cannon. Break tech cannon. All right, very cool. I think that's it, huh? How do I sell stuff? Well, I probably have to wait for the market then. All right. So do we pick a random? Oh, okay. Uh, bonus. So if we join. Looks like if you make choices and become, you know, good friends, you get stuff. Reputation, all factions, reduced duration of demonstration. Yeah, I have no idea. All right, next mission here. Factory Seoul, Seoul, Canada, Seoul, Korea. This Sarah lady is waving at us. All right. Let me introduce you 
to John Wintz. He's the leader of Human Bots. Uh, my dear, blah, blah, blah. Accommodations to gauge the situation. Oh, look what we got here. I went trying to uh, preach to a new audience. Not to kill anyone on your way here. Super machine, your allies. You got it. All right, next mission here. A uh, factory that still oozes liquefied metal and molten thorium. This is where it all began. Ah, robots, weapons, chips. We'll break the door down. Goal. Get some gear together. Let's begin. Okay, we don't know where we are. It's all random. Whoa, free stuff. You squeeze that to the very last drop of oil on your chancer. We're not going to go down that easily. Access to the next sector is unlocked. Okay. All right, going down. We go down again. Okay, we're going to go left. Oh, Metabot. Oh, what's your transmute? Let's try hacking it. Come on. Oh, that was very close. Group of enemies discovered. Oh, that's good. That means we're going to get first strike. All right, that's great. Let's go right, and we'll go right again. EMP device. Oh, no. We'll just deactivate it. I want nothing to do with this. Oh my god, it's so scary. Alright, let's go up. I, mean, I'm here. I want to explore the rooms, you know? Oh, it's a battle. Oh, oh special agents instead of riflemen. Just show them what kind of alloy robots are made of. Alright, so we got a good upgrade for shield stabilization, but we know no needs yet. So let's focus down the weak one. Alright, oh, check it out. Proton's supposed to go up to three people now. Poof, poof, poof. Pretty good. Artistic performance. Offended, charmed, and ethereal, ethereal focused. It's really good. Take this, brah. Ooh, he got charmed. Oh, here comes the damage. Pretty ah, uh, they're nothing. Weak sauce. Ow. Oh god. Oh, I'm gonna have to heal my own shield. There's no problem. Shield heal. All right. Once again, I will proton shots. Next turn, I'm gonna have the regular here. Nice. He's down. All right, we're doing great. No one's taking any um, hull damage yet. It's just their shield, which is great. All right. Uh, should we be safe and heal the shield? Yeah, let's do it. No rush, no rush. We have to do a regular attack to uh, lower our overload. We can keep doing stuff here. Cool, so she's going to debuff and do a little damage. This guy is, of course, the crazy guy. Going all out. I like this team. It's pretty cool. All right, let's go ahead and keep on recovering our shields. All right, it's low again. Here we go. Does it bounce again to him? One, two. Oh, I would hope it would go back to him. That would be pretty cool. Charm, sucker. All right. Oh, don't hit him, please. No, 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 no. Oh, that was very close. I thought I was going to take out shield. All right, we're good. Everyone lower your stuff. She can't really do anything. Everything here takes up... Uh... Yeah, everything she has here takes up... Uh... Ooh. That's crazy, huh? She has no attacks that give her not overload. Alright, let's just kick his ass. I can't do anything. Can't do a damn thing. Kick his ass, eh? Thorium. Regenerate shield of all. Oh, I understand now. God dang it. So if I hit him for like 60, it's gonna heal us for like 34, or 33 or something. Yeah, or something like that. Oh. I was confused. It's his enemy to us. I understand. We're not sure why Jockloff henchmen were hanging out. We should do our best to extinguish the flames of fire. Cool. More money and more equipment. Alright. What's this? Soldering iron. It's a gadget. I don't know what that's going to do for us. Uh, soldering iron. What's this? A laser eye? Soldering iron? Gadget. Does this give us a new ability? Because it looks like another weapon. Common gadget. I don't know. Alright. Oh, check it out. More freaking stuff. This is great. We're getting, we're getting tons of stuff per fight. I love it. Okay, going to the right. Uh, hack. Danger level plus 20 because we failed the hack. Dang. If we get to 30, we get chance to lower down. Intoxicate. What's this do? Success chance failed. Well, I don't even know what that's supposed to do if we leave it there. Alright. Uh, operational. Upload it into yourselves. You need to fight against the brake tech. Reactivate abandoned robot. 
Reporting for duty. Wait, he's on my team now? Oh, shit. Oh, we got a new robot. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Let's see what you can do. Maybe I have some stuff to put on you. Oh, oh he's already wearing a bunch of stuff. Look at that. We can get this one here. Uh, this one's already better. Oh, this thing's garbage. This is way better. Oh, my God. This guy's a badass. I can level him up. I don't know what your abilities are. Let's see. Rifle shot. Basic rifle. Cyber boots. Deals damage and reduces enemy speed. Ooh. Deal 79 to an enemy line. An enemy line. Hmm. That's pretty cool. Uh, applies protected to an ally. Cool. What's What are your other skills? Corrosive grenade. All enemies. Yo, that sounds pretty damn good. Uh, provac uh, provocating shout. Applies provoked. Thorium smoked grenade. Whoa, dude. Alright, how about we get rid of shockwave and instead we pick up this corrosive grenade instead. Oh, you can just buy it. You don't have to freaking like use the talent. Holy crap. I don't know that. Alright, how wait. Is there anything for a corrosive grenade? This is a corrosive grenade, right? Also has a chance to apply thorium focus. Yes. Yes. Dude. Hold on. Let's switch it out then. Enhanced speed. Deal 48 to all enemies in weak spots. Neurotic ammo. Uh, deals 91 to an enemy. Ooh. You got basic strikes. So this is good for one guy. This is good for a lot of people. Short circuit. These are okay. I mean, another AOE would be amazing. All right, my lady here needs a new attack, right? Dang, she already has all of her attacks unlocked. Yeah, that's her ability, huh? So she can't do any of this. It's all unlocked already. It's not even that great. All right, let's go. Let's go. I'm liking this game. It's cool, man. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go down. Oh, of course. Oh, 4v3, 4v4. Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, okay, what are we going to do here? Should we start attacking? Thorium mark to an ally line. What happens if I... Oh, here we go. All right, Thorium marked. We're stronger. Shields up. Protect the back line. And we will do Proton Shot. Look at this cybernetic guardian. Uh, take out this guy first. Damn, that's strong. All right, my lady. Stalk to all enemies. Taking damage regenerates the shield of the assailant. Oh, conversion. Each heal increases power up. Shield to all allies. Damage transfer to an ally and the launcher. Uh, immaterial barrier. Damage is reduced as long as the shield is above. What? For three turns. God, it's not that great. All right. Yeah, her stuff's crazy. Like, it's, it's very situational. Another good support class. All right, let's keep going. All right, time to use the corrosive grenade. We leveled up. All enemies, attack. Woo, nice. That's great. Oh, yeah, I love turn-based battles. Let's go. You have all the time in the world to think. All right, all right, we're doing good. I said we just attack now. Boom. Damn, took him out. Little guy, little guru. All right, proton shots. Ba ba ba. Oh, such a good attack, man. Yo, this guy's running out of shield. Might as well keep going. Uh, keep going with the close of shots. That's very strong. My God. Boom. Nice, nice, very cool, very cool. If we leave him alone, he might just perish next turn. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Let him die. Well, actually, that doesn't matter. We're gonna use some AOE again. Uh, we're about to overload. Yeah, we're gonna overload here, but that's okay. We're about to win. Yeah, we're about to win. No problemo. Uh, he's still in corrosion. 10% of maximum shield and structure combined. Per yeah, yeah. Let's not worry about him because he's gonna die, right? It doesn't matter. Just overload. Yeah, sucker. Cool, man. Oh, yeah. These guys got nothing. Ba boom and regular attack. Thank you very much. Ooh, got a lot of stuff. We got a new weapon and we got something called a titanium record. Structure repaired by 10% after a fight. Whoa, whoa. How do you use that? Structure repaired. Who uses that? This guy can use this theta polymorphic base. The bottom 39 regular, seven more regeneration shield. Ooh, that's way better. Ooh, look, his feet change. 
His feet change. I like that. Oh, we got a new thingy? No, no, no. All right, cool, man. Oh, yeah. Yes, yes. Wait, so what the hell does this thing do? What does it do? It's a gadget. I, I'm gonna get just extra damage or something. I have no freaking clue. Anyways, guys. That'll be it for today's episode of Mob Impressions. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like. It helps a lot. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. Upload a lot of daily videos. This has been Robothorium. Now, to give you my first 30 minutes or so thoughts, it's a really good game. I like it a lot. This is like right up my alley, you know, jumping right in. It's a little bit of a roguelike. I don't know what happens if we actually lose. So, I don't know if the game is completely over or if you just restart or something like that. But it's nice. You get to choose your team, a lot of customization. Pretty great. So, please let me know your guys' opinions down below. I gave you mine. What's yours? Uh, stay tuned for more mob impressions every single day. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.